moving all the way to Rwanda from the border region. Please welcome M. Fojo. <laughs> Muraho, Rwanda, Habari, Ghana. I would like to say a very big thank you to the Almighty God for bringing me this far. Puna Hinfu, Jumfo, Mrashebe Jumfo, Sewanyaku Old Student, Honorable William Okofo Date, and then Chias Rokon Brehuina Nanda Huaseso, Samoa Somasina Besi Samri. Tonight, I bring you all the way to the land of many possibilities. Yes, welcome to the Republic. Of Rwanda. I can say that the Kwani Okoswo, Timasre Hunina, Sahumba Koswa Twamam, short code here, star 713, star 13 hash. And now, so bet me, I download the TV3 reality app for Google Play Store and now Apple App Store. And what about your mom for you? M F O D W O, Santa Sana, Mercy Boku, and Dahunina. Mfojo is closed by. F Penta Clothing with hair by Best and More Limited. Ladies well groomed by African American Beauty Academy. Inspiring beauty beyond borders. Accessories by Magdal Kutu. <laughs> To the father of our land, His Excellency Paul Kagami. Habari za usiku wa bibi na wabuana. Ningna furaha kuwa nai kuwa leza tamanduni naiza ya wa Rwanda. Greetings to you all. Welcome to the cleanest country in the whole of Africa. Welcome to the land of possibilities, to the land of safaris, and to the land of friendly locals. I welcome you all to the Republic of Rwanda, with our capital city as Kigali. And what I'm wearing tonight is our traditional outfit called Umushanana, and this makes us very unique. Known for its breathtaking scenery, Rwanda is often referred to as Le Pays de Mel Colin, meaning the land of a thousand hills. With a population of over 12.6 million and with a rich and varied culture, each Rwandese speaks two or three of our languages, with our national language as Kerewanda and the others being English, French, and Kiswahili. We pride ourselves as one of the only three countries in the world with female majority in parliament, with about 60% representation of women. And so, oh yes, we believe strongly in women empowerment. Since good food is good mood, you can never visit my land without tasting our sweet Ugali, not to talk of our delicious Esombi, which is a very rich source of fiber, and there are many more rich delicacies in my country. Our traditional music and <laughs> thank you. Thank you very much. Our traditional music and dances are displayed during all ceremonies like festivals, social gatherings, even storytelling. And our cultural heritage revolves around our dances, our praise songs, our traditional crafts like basketry, our poetry, our drums, and so many more. Hmm. Rwanda, like any other country, has faced tragedies. I remember from April to July 1994, when the day seemed like night and all so cold. Over one million lives lost in 100 days. Ethnic extremism became the order of the day. The catastrophe and the calamity thus brought, the genocide against the Tutsi. Uruguanda, Uguara, Senyotsi. Rwanda has faced wars and destructions, but we never held back to victory. And just like Confucius once said, our greatest glory is not in never falling, but in rising up each time that we fall. And so Rwanda rose again, and is now a force to reckon with. Oh, the resilience. I believe that we all can take a cue out of this, that no matter how hard you fall, just pick yourself up again and keep moving forward because out of tragedy comes strength. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Rwanda, as a very wonderful country, can boast of eight museums that conserves and exhibits our heritage through culture, 
arts and science. We also have over 500 heritage sites countrywide. And so just like Ghanaians pride in culture, norms and ethics, we the people of Rwanda do same. Culture is indeed dynamic. Culture is unique. Culture is beautiful. Culture is powerful. Culture is our identity. And our culture is who we are. Amabara Tandukanye Uruguanda Rumwe, Kanimwe, Africa Imwe. Different colors, one Rwanda, one Ghana, one Africa. Harakaba hu Uruguanda, Harakaba hu Ghana, Harakaba hu Umunia Africa. Long live Rwanda, long live Ghana, long live Africa. <laughs> And Fodjo from so, the Bono region. And so once again, much greetings to the father of our land, His Excellency Paul Kagami, Kuajina Naito and Fodjo, Nitwa Rwanda, Murakoze, Asante Sana, Merci Woku, Ndahuninase. Okay. And Fodjo. Now, Janet is not done writing. Can I come to you to comment on her performance? Uh. Please do. Infojo, well done. Thank you. So I've been to Rwanda a couple of times, and you actually personify the gentle nature of a Rwandan. And I've been to the genocide museums. It's, it's indeed a very sad and somber occasion. And during that part of your speech, I, would, I was expecting you that you would be very somber and sad. But anyway, the fact that they rose up again and they are building their country and the women there are very strong and very, very industrious. And I admire the fact that you try to speak some Swahili, some local language, interjecting your performance with uh, the local flair. I commend you for that. Well done, Infojo. Well done, Infojo. Now let's move to Amanziba for his comments. Um, your performance should be sent to Rwanda. Yes. Um, what I love about you most is when you, you pause to acknowledge the applause as, as, as a mark of, of respect and appreciation for, of what people are giving you. But I'm telling you that maybe if I have to make a prediction or prophesy, you're going to be the best ambassador for both countries, Ghana and Rwanda. Wow. Yeah. <laughs> Congratulations to you, Infojo. Now, if she did it for you tonight, you can also keep her in the competition. Star 713, Star 13, add her name, Infojo.